Welcome to the Franklin School District MAC Tech Tips. In this episode, we will discuss knowing when a program is open and how to easily switch between open programs. Looking at a basic desktop, if you move your mouse cursor down to the dock, you'll notice all your different program icons. Any program icon that has a black triangle underneath it means that that program is currently open and currently running on the machine. So a good thing to know would be if your computer starts to run really slow, you should choose to quit these programs that you know are open. And there's a few different ways you can quit those programs. One way is you could just click on the icon to switch to that program. And the way that you know you're in that program is the top drop-down menu changes and this first menu choice over here is the name of that program. So right now I'm in Safari. You could go to the Safari drop-down and choose to quit Safari and that would totally close the program out. That's one way to quit a basic program. Another way that's a little bit of a shortcut, if you look at your dock and say you want to quit Word, you put your mouse cursor over the Word icon and do a click and hold and it brings up a mini menu. One of the choices on the mini menu is to quit. So you select quit and you let go of the mouse click and now it is quitting Word. And notice the black triangle just went away. One way to cycle easily between programs as a shortcut is by using a shortcut key. If you hold down the Apple key on the keyboard and press tab, it brings up a menu in the middle of your screen of the programs that are currently running. Still holding Apple and pressing tab, it cycles between the programs that you have open. So if you quickly want to navigate to your email, you go to GroupWise, and now nothing comes up, but that's only because GroupWise is located down in the dock. But let's say as an example that you have a PowerPoint file open and you want to quickly get to your email. You would just use Apple tab and switch to your email. And that concludes our first tech tip about how to switch between programs, how to know if programs are open. There will be more tech tips in the future. Thanks for watching.